All right, well, anyway, we're talking about the Dodge's march back into NASCAR, and it started really back in, in 90, 91, 92 with Archer Brothers running Trans Am Racing SCCA. Um, we all sort of met each other, the people involved, at SEMA in 91, if I'm not mistaken. And, um, you know, Dodge was, was, uh, it was really their Mopar parts division that was looking at it, not necessarily Dodge as the manufacturer. And <clears throat> at that time, you know, parts were not really stockpiled like you would need it to field three or four Trans Am cars. So, you know, we had to rely on a lot of inventory that my dad had left over and inventory that Dodge was not aware that they even had at the time. So, uh, Anyway, fast forward, you know, we run two full seasons with four Trans Am cars with the Archer Brothers. And then in 95, the, the NASCAR Truck Series started without Dodge. And actually, the there was a few uh, teams there that run Dodge. Walker Evans, who was off-road team, and I think maybe there was one other that run in 95 and then got NASCAR's, not NASCAR, but got uh, Dodge's interest to pursue a uh, factory team or teams in NASCAR. So, and then when they, when they had their meeting, uh, when I say they, NASCAR and Dodge had their meeting, they actually had their, one of the very first meetings at my shop in Martinsville. And, uh, you know, there was, a, there was a learning curve for NASCAR and a learning curve for Dodge of who had what and what the rules were at the time and, you know, how to get it moving. And, and so, you know, it was a long, hard uh, winter in 95 because, you know, Dodge started their factory effort in, in 96 with the Mopar Dodge truck. And uh, uh, I think Dennis Setcher drove it. And then there was a couple other do factory Dodge trucks, uh, Petty's Dodge truck for one, and there was maybe one more. And, and uh, it was a struggle getting parts early on. But that's, that's sort of the first heavy swing at NASCAR and truck. So now you made the comment about um, like them meeting with NASCAR to see who has what. Whenever like a manufacturer does come into a, to a sport, um, is that something where they get a look at what the other manufacturers are doing or is it just NASCAR says, here's the basic rules that everyone has to follow? What, um, the manufacturers that are involved in NASCAR have to provide um, body panels, some of the body panels for the vehicle. They have to provide the engine block, the engine cylinder head castings, uh, timing cover and a water pump, and a couple of part num different part numbers for intake manifold. That is what's required by NASCAR. The, the manufacturer has to have a approved part number from them as manufacturer to present to NASCAR. 